pot be like Actually, I already started my day off. I went and dropped my parents off at the airport. They are leaving for Florida for a week, so me and the dog went and dropped them off at the airport. And right now I'm just uh, finished breakfast, catching up on some of the YouTube videos, some of the people that I follow. Um, I get asked a lot, like, who do you follow? Who's like your, you know, people you look up to? Um, on YouTube, like my favorite, favorite people, uh, Dosa Fusi. I don't know if you guys know Fusi too. He's probably like my favorite. I've been watching him for a long, long time. Um, he's really cool. Nothing really to do fitness related, even though he did do that pretty cool transformation. Um, Max Tuning, really, really awesome guy. He's funny. He's very um, much himself. Really look up to that guy. Uh, the online coach, Raymond Cudera, I think you say his last name. Obviously, Christian Guzman. Guzman. Guzman? Whatever. Um, he's one of my favorite. Uh, Rob Lipset. You guys haven't heard of him. He's from, from Ireland. He's really, really cool. Um, I watch a couple other randoms, but those are like the main ones that I always, always watch. So um, I usually start my mornings off watching a couple of those videos just to, uh, I don't know, keep, keep motivated. Keep me, um, you know, and I mean, honestly, it's always good to watch other people, especially when you're doing YouTube. It's good to watch other people, see what they're doing. Not necessarily steal their items, but, you know, um, I guess kind of. Okay, kind of steal their items, whatever. Anyways, uh, yeah, we got a pretty slow day today, honestly. I'm going to be chilling most of the day. Um, my first client's not till 7 tonight, and I have a class before that, and I have class at 6. So I'm probably just going to hang out for a couple hours, probably binge watch some Game of Thrones, go hit shoulders around 3, and yeah, it's going to be my day. So let's get it. clean finally. I haven't gave her a bath in like two months. It's been a long, long time since she's been cleaned. Watch this, this is the best part about coming home. Just wait and see what is about to happen. <gasps> what are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. Hi, yeah, baby. Oh. Oh. So I've pretty much decided that this vlog just gonna be a day in the life vlog. Why not? Bring you guys along. See what I do every day. It's nothing really. Literally, I train clients, tan sometimes, I work out, I eat a lot of food, drink a lot of water. That's it. That's all I do. What are you guys doing in there? Hmm. Weird. Anyways, it's time for meal number two. All right, so before I sit down and eat my second meal, I want to show you guys real quick how I'm looking. I've only had one meal today. Um, last night was my cheat meal. So I'm going to show you guys kind of how I'm coming along right now. Let me get that out of the way. Nice and tight. The extra sodium really brings out some vascularity. And some extra striations. Mm. 
shoulders are looking good. A little back shot there. Lower back is leaned out a lot. Finally. Yep. So, as you can see, we're coming along pretty good. Sitting out, I think, what? Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. Nine days? Nine days out? Nine days out. I think nine days out. I could be wrong. Correct me if I am. And yeah, um, I don't know if I'm going to get much leaner. You guys can't see me. I don't know if I'm going to get much leaner than I already am. Maybe just a slight bit, but I mean, I'm pretty, I'm pretty good right now. So just going to try to keep the energy levels high, keep the mood high. Grind this out. I'm going to eat. <coughs> Excuse me. Time to eat. Pre-workout meal. Protes. Protein and oats. It's like my favorite meal of the day. I look forward to this meal every day. I don't know why, but like the combination of my protein and oats just is really good. The consistency, the taste, everything. And actually like when I'm done eating this, I feel full. Which is a rare, rare, rare thing these days. So yeah. <laughs> Well, home from the gym now. Late day, I didn't film any of it because I worked out at like 5 o'clock. And the gym was crazy. So now I'm doing cardio in my attic. Because I got a treadmill up here. So get to see that beautiful view. Do my cardio. Yeah, so we're going to do that. Catch you the guys when I'm done. Just kind of relaxing a little bit right now. Drinking my aminos. And yeah, um, but I wanted to talk to you guys because I have an announcement to make. Um, some of you who have watched my videos already know this, but um, I'm assuming probably most of you don't. Um, something I've been wanting to kind of talk about for a little while, but I haven't been able to, but I feel like now's um, a, a good time, and I feel like now it's not gonna affect anything. Pretty much everyone who needs to know knows. So um, I will no longer be now this is effective in two weeks, a week after my show. Um, I will no longer be working at Gold's Gym. Um, I uh, put my two weeks in there a little while ago, and we agreed to um, me working and staying there for a little while, finishing out some clients, and uh, helping out, um, you know, being on staff since they are low on personal trainers. So um, I did agree to, to stay for a little bit. Um, a lot of you guys are probably wondering why this happened. Um, to make a long story short, um, basically I do online training, obviously. Everyone knows my website uh, that I do do online training through and Gold's Gym has a no compete or no whatever, no compete thing. Um, and now while my online business didn't affect Gold's Gym, it actually brought clients to it. Um, it the information of my personal training online got into the wrong hands of someone someone who um, I'm just gonna go ahead and guess that they're jealous or um, I don't I don't I don't know I, I don't want to say anything bad about this person but um definitely little child was moved but I'm not really upset about it uh, I didn't plan on being at Gold's much longer anyways um, because really Gold's is not where I plan to take my career I didn't even plan for to work for a gym when I quit in the car business and um, I decided to work there and I'm glad I did. I've worked there for probably eight months. I learned a lot. I learned a lot about you know the personal training business. I learned a lot um, as a trainer. Um, I learned how to become a group exercise instructor. I learned a lot of things. It was a great time. I met a lot of great people at Gold's Gym and you know my boss Drew, he's awesome. Um, no, no bridges are burned you know with me leaving there so I don't want people to think like I'm leaving on bad terms or anything like that. Like everyone at Gold's Gym knows that I've, I've been um, planning on leaving and there's absolutely no bad blood in between that um, I plan to 
still be a member there. I'm going to buy a membership and work out there. Um, and I'll still be around. So a lot of you guys who are watching this who go to Gold's Gym, uh, don't worry, I'll still be around there. Still working out there and whatnot. So this isn't like I'm leaving Gold's Gym forever. It's just I won't be working there anymore. Um, I'm going to be freelancing. I'm going to be taking clients to a couple different gyms here in Akron, Ohio. Um, I'm going to be doing small group training outside, um, small group training at a couple of different gyms. I'm going to be doing a boot camp class outside three days a week, which I will have announcements for that when I get that set. Um, if you guys are interested in those boot camp classes, they're going to be $10 a person. They're going to be about an hour to an hour and a half long class outside. Um, if you guys are interested in them, please um, comment below with the time slot that you would like it at, a day, and a location that you would think would fit best for you because I'm trying to fit everyone's needs with that so I'm trying to get a kind of a majority vote as to you know days times and location to where I should have it at I have a couple places in mind but again you know these classes are for you guys so I want you to kind of want you guys to be the, the main deciding factor on on that so um, I will be promoting a lot more online business. Uh, my plans are going to be getting cheaper. I'm going to be doing subscriptions for my training so you can buy a one-time package and then it'll be a uh, small monthly charge for me to continue to um, you know, work with you. So I'm going to be doing a lot more marketing with that. I'm going to be doing uh, a lot of engine training. Like I said, small group training is where I really plan to focus. So. Um, really, this is just you know the start of me as a trainer, and I'm really looking forward to it. I'm really happy. Um, you know, I know, I, I've known I've I was ready to to leave Golds, and now it's just the perfect time. So I'm finishing up my show, um, finishing up a couple clients I have at Golds, and then I am going to be leaving there. So um, again, thank you to everyone at the Golds Gym team. Um, it was great being a part of it you know, while it lasted, but, uh, you know, it's time for me to blossom. It's time for me to step to the next step in my career. And, you know, that's what it's all about guys, just moving forward. So that is my announcement. So yeah, again, don't be upset. I will be still around there. I'll still be working out. I'll still be taking some classes, whatnot at Gold's. I might even stay on like small part time. It's a group exercise instructor because everyone really likes my app class there. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, I will no longer be a personal trainer at Gold's Gym. So thank you guys for listening and enjoy the rest of the video. Boy, you should know that I've got you on my mind. Your secret admirer. I've been watching.